Okay, welcome back everybody. Um, today we've got the Rad 5 here and I was going to talk about something that um, it's been a, a subject of interest uh, to myself as an independent researcher. I always like to get the facts for myself and <clears throat> regarding the Orgone uh, generator radionics devices such as the RAD5. I'm actually using the RAD5 because it's a more powerful uh, device. And uh, so there's been a lot of, I wouldn't say a lot, but there's been some speculation, some concerns, some ideas about uh, these devices being um, like, like producing um, uh, radiation, like radioactive radiation. And <clears throat> so being that I've got a family and I'm always uh, concerned about getting to the bottom of these things, I uh, actually picked one of these up. This is a, a GMC 320 uh, nuclear radiation detector, <clears throat> Geiger Muller counter. So basically CPM, it equals, this is in other words, this is the counts per minute. So the counts per minute basically is how the number of particles in uh, any given um, environment, uh, which could include alpha <clears throat> or beta particles. Uh, those are different forms of, of nuclear radiation, ionizing radiation. Uh, but they're not uh, including the, the gamma or x-rays. Those are different forms of ionizing radiation. So. Uh, basically, this I've noticed is going between, that's probably the lowest I've seen it, 7 or 8, and it goes up to, to, to 22. And I've noticed that it'll, it'll make pretty big jumps based upon uh, time of day, etc. Uh, but I'm going to, I'm basically, I've got this right next to the mechanism here. I'm going to put this down right there. And uh, I'm just going to turn, turn this on. Now that's pretty low. You'll see that it'll probably... Again, it's going up and down. I've seen it go up to as far as, and this is anywhere in our house, mind you, as up as far as 22 or 23. Now, I wanted to give you kind of a relativity on what you're seeing here. The 8 CPM, which is now it should, would be going up massively if this was of any kind of a, a radiation threat. <clears throat> I'm going to read a couple statistics here. Okay, so according to the radiation... Uh, network, uh, 100 CPM, 100, is considered a warning level. Now, according to um, the Modern Survival blog, a fellow by the name of Ken um, Jorgestein, I hope I'm saying his name right there, um, it would take 432 days at a CPM of 100 uh, to up your chance of getting cancer to odds of 1 in 1,000. And so if, for instance, is at 10,000 CPM, it would take four days to increase your odds to 1 in 1,000. Now, <clears throat> mind you, um, the statistics I'm giving you are based on uh, the Radiation Network uh, website and uh, the, the two, two specific blogs that I uh, that were really well referenced that I are uh, well written blogs I should say that were um, selected um, so we're gonna provide those for you under the video so you can check it out for yourself but <clears throat> as you can see it's oscillating a little bit as it always does in an environment it will go kinda of between 7 or 8 up to 22 and that's uh, nowhere even near what it would take to be considered that 100 mark to be considered a, a threat or danger to anybody in any environment. So I just wanted to give that as a practical relationship to uh, what we're working with here in relationship to the, the nuclear radiation. Uh, nothing. So these devices, as far as I can see, uh, according to the empirical evidence that I've gathered, are absolutely clean and not only that they're just they're fun they're amazing and you can uh, do so much 
uh, with them. You know, it's, it's just, it's a constant deepening learning curve about life, about your own um, expressions. It really is um, ever deepening my core experience with life. So, you know, check it out. Go to orgongenerator.com. Um, look at these devices and you can do so uh, feeling in full confidence that uh, what we're dealing with here is virtually just only ambient background radiation nothing that these devices uh, appear to be generating in any way shape or form all right everybody many blessings and to your health and happiness till next time